Fifty Shades Darker movie. Oscar and Tony winner Marsha Gay Harden plays Christian Grey's adoptive mother. Take a look as she greets her son and Anastasia Steele as they arrive for a party. Everybody's looking at us. Not us. You. Christian, I'm so glad you made it. Mother. Mother, so formal, honestly. <laughs> um, Hi. Hey. How you doing? <sighs> These things are beautiful and they are mysterious. They're a pain in the ass. <laughs> you look spectacular. Thank you. So do you. This dress is so beautiful. Thank you, Anna. <laughs> I'm so glad you're back with Christian. He was lost without you. Can I have my date back, well, please? <laughs> by all means, spoil, spoil. <laughs> Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Good Hello, morning. Good morning. Good How morning. How are you? <laughs> I'm great. Okay, I can't help. Matt was teasing it, saying that this movie has changed your perspective. Uh, in what way? Well, you know, I'm a mom. Yeah. I've got three kids. Yeah. My mornings, my days are all about get the kids to school, go to work, make sure they have lunches. Suddenly, I'm in Fifty Shades. And uh, I go to the Vancouver airport, and there's just statues, just beautiful statues, Normal. airport art. And yeah. I'm like, oh, they're so sensual. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the round curves of that one and the hard lines of that one. It's a man and a woman. Now I'm on the street, and I'm like, oh, hello. I mean, <laughs> what is, what my kids happening? are like, mom. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I'm like, nothing's wrong with me. <laughs> I mean, Your kids are teenagers, right? Well, they're 12, 12. and then I have an 18-year-old. And yes. an 18. Are they horrified, excited? How do they feel about you in this movie? Well, your language really slows down when you try to explain the movie to them, yeah. and you start mumbling, like that's what they normally do. <laughs> right. But now I'm doing it, I'm like, well, it's a movie. <laughs> And um, the character likes to be spanked. Like, what? What Mom, are you talking did about? Did you say spanked? I'm like, never mind. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> so you play Christian Gray's mother. Mother, right. And he had a troubled uh, childhood, is right. a fair way to say it. Tell us about a little bit about your character. But you know what was interesting for me is that because the movie is about what it's about, it's an erotic fantasy, yeah. but it's really a romance. It's a romantic fantasy. So what are the women characters in it? And my characters, I think, are very important because yeah. she's the mom, she's nurturing, she adopted him, and she's the first person who's trying to sort of heal him through the powers of love. She just doesn't know about this other dark side. And she's a mama bear. She's a, bear, a real protector. There's a scene when, with Kim Basinger where she understands what role Kim played in his sort of sexual um, understanding understanding of himself and so, she, so Kim Basinger's character is kind, yeah. kind of abused your she's abused my son right and my character understands it and she lets her know who's boss how does she let her know let me show you wait so this is a scene we're gonna reenact a scene okay. the one we can from Fifty Shades it's so, like this. so you come upon Kim Basinger yes. who you're so angry That's at right. because she and I say stay the hell away from my son and then I say <laughs> Wow. Look look at your hair. Wow. And now you're all 50. And I just have to say, for the audiences, I only did one and she wanted more. She is so 50. I she did. Won, I won I two. asked for two. So, well, anywho. So, um, <laughs> This movie, by the way, is more, there's more love story, isn't there, in this one than there was in the well, last. Well, you know, this is, I think that is what has women all over America yeah. and the world, actually. I mean, there's huge fan all over the world, the fan base, is because while it is a story that is fantastical, that is somewhat fluff on some level, it's also the underneath is a story of love. Mm -hmm. And it's every woman's wildest dream to meet the b beautiful specimen of Dorn and, and mm -hmm. gorgeous man, billionaire there but to change the bad boy. Right. That's what we all want to do is change the bad boy. And she does sort of through the power of love. Yeah, E.L., we had E.L. James on earlier, yeah. and she was talking about how that was an important part of it, and also the part of it that had to do with the thrill. There's like more of a thriller part of this right. movie. Different there's components, thriller, right? There's action. There's the, you know, you can look into it on so many levels, and you can say, <laughs> oh, no, they're playing the slap back. <laughs> um, that she's, it's also about women setting boundaries and saying no, and that's what the character does. She says no. I think we have to wrap it up with two more of the slaps. I mean, oh, I think it has because I, I know. We can, more. Come on, hit me. You are ready so, for You're 50. mad at me. Okay, I'm mad at you. Take that. Take that. And now kiss me. No. <laughs> <laughs> that is 50. <laughs> Marsha Gay Harden, thank you. And by the way, Marsha's going to be back again with yes. Kathy Lee and myself. Uh, and you're, we're going to talk about that. Coming up. Ex